Today, I am going to do a review on Ted Dechter's graphic novel, Black. If you started living in two different worlds, how would you feel if every time you went to sleep, you awoke in a new world, never knowing which one is real? This is exactly what happens to Thomas Hunter when he is chased at night by someone in New York and shot at, but barely making it alive to his sister's house. Next thing Thomas knows, he awakes in a black forest with no memory of how he got there. Now it is up to Thomas Hunter to find his memory and what happened, but is led by a rouse to a color forest where everything seems to be perfect. Now, is this world real or fake? The art is very clean, but my only complaint is that Thomas Hunter and a lot of the other characters in this graphic novel look too similar from one another. As you see in the scene, the panels do not flow as easy as they should, and the sound effects come way too late, despite it being an action scene. There is one character they do get right, and that is the white bat and the rouch. I feel like the creators gave them a lot more attention to the personality than any other character in this graphic novel. This scene right here shows the rouch speaking to Thomas Hunter and how they seem to overshadow him. There is a character called Eli that is represented as our God, and it has an interesting twist on creation. This is a great graphic novel if you're into graphic novels. The characters may not be as memorable and pacing might be off, but the premise is so intriguing. So if you're interested in buying this graphic novel, um, I'll have a link in the description. Thank you for tuning in to this channel. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to subscribe, you can subscribe too. I will also have a video link to uh, the playlist of original films. And until next time, I will see you later.